Hello YouTube, this is the Crack Project and in this tutorial we're going to teach you how you can create your own server using the new server mod Bucket which can be found at bucket.org. Alright then, so first first matter is to make a folder where your uh, server is going to be. I created one already, that's tcp underscore example. Um, now just find um, go to bamboo.lukegb.com. This is where the bucket uh, files are stored and look for bucket craft bucket first. Um, find the artifacts and find where it says craft, craft bucket jar. I'm going to just download that real quick. Then go back to the home page, find bucket main, click that, click artifacts, download the bucket jar. Okay, so now we have both our buckets files right here. We're gonna go to downloads folder and copy them real quick. Go back to the folder we made here and paste. Next thing we need to do is create a file that starts our server. So how we're, this is how we're gonna do that. We're gonna open start and find notepad. And I'll just go ahead and really quickly save save the file to the location of your where you want your server to be save it as click all files and you should you should show up like the normal and type some whatever you want start server dot bat make sure it's dot bat that means it's an executable batch file save that okay so now what we need to do is um, we have to paste in our start code for our server there are two start codes if you have a 64-bit operating system there's a 64-bit version. If you have a 32-bit operating system, there's a 32-bit start code. So I'm just going to go ahead and paste that in. Alright, I've pasted in the start code for my 64-bit operating system. I also, I'll include both the 64-bit and the 32-bit codes in the description of the video. Now I'm just going to save this and close it. And this should be all just about all you have in your, in your server file. That's normal. All you got to do is double-click on Start Server. Okay. Hold on one second. I think I had this problem before, and it's because there's a dash right in front of exe. If you see that dash, go ahead and take that out, close this, and start it, and there you go. Now, uh, you should see some errors like you did if you watched my other tutorial. Um, the um, bucket is it created the server files because it couldn't find them as you can see there like band IPs, band players, ops, all that and now it is generating a world it's, as you can see the generated world is in this folder is all that stuff and just to show you that it works you can see it's running now there are no plugins installed as you can see here I'll go over that in the next tutorial you can just open up Minecraft log in <coughs> go to multiplayer and type in localhost and kaboom there's your brand new uh, Minecraft server and running bucket. In the next tutorial, I'll go over um, how to port forward, and then after that, I will ex uh, explain how you can install plugins, and maybe if I have time, I might even explain how you can create plugins for your bucket server. Thanks, guys.